villagers across Hampshire are taking part in a heyday, clearing the edges of their local recreation ground. They let the area grow wild to create a haven for pollinators, insects such as bees, butterflies, moths and beetles that transfer pollen between plants, enable them to reproduce and grow fruits and seeds. This is what the area looked like before it was cut back, with flowers, blackberries and grasses. It's hoped that more wildflowers will grow back next year and in turn attracting more pollinators. There are around 1,500 species of insect pollinators in the UK, but their numbers are in decline. One of the major threats is a loss of natural habitat. That's why Hampshire County Council is asking community groups to take a pollinator pledge, a commitment to improve their local environment for these amazing creatures. That's what they're doing in Burriton, with villagers working together to identify land across the parish from recreation grounds to gardens that can be a haven for wildlife. The edges have not been mown for the last year um, until yesterday and what we're doing today is getting as many people from the community as possible to come and clear away the cuttings because our understanding is if we leave that there to rot down the fertility of the soil it still remains too high and you get all the wrong sorts of flowers and, and weeds and things growing that aren't great for pollinators. We're fairly confident that if we come back in five or ten years time we'll have a lovely showing of wild flowers which then themselves are great for pollinators as well. We want Hampshire to be a place where pollinators such as bees, butterflies, wasps and beetles can survive and thrive. That's why we're supporting the pollinator strategy and taking climate change action.